My dear beloved people, I greet you all in the holy name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Our God is a good God and his mercy endures forever. Every day early in the morning we are hearing the word of God and it's a very big privilege given to us. So far God has led us and guided us. Amen. Even now he is going to lead us and guide us from the day he chose us. God's hand has led you. Your knowledge, your money, uh, your position, nothing has led you. God has led you so far. Amen. God's name be glorified. My dear beloved people, every day with Holy Spirit on this topic, every day we are getting a prophetic word from God and we hear it from God, we believe it and God is graciously leading us. Today what God is going to say to us? Let's go to the word. The prophetic book of Isaiah chapter 10 and verses 27. It shall come to pass in that day that his burden will be taken away from your shoulder and his yoke from your neck and the yoke shall be destroyed because of the anointing. In English, it, it is very clearly saying that because of the anointing, yoke shall be removed. Because of the anointing, the yoke shall be broken, removed. That's what we read. Okay. What is the yoke before you? What is the yoke? I hope you, you understand what is the yoke is. On those days, in a bullock cart, on the neck of a bull, they will have a rod and it will be tied up with the neck. And they will have a lot of load upon the bullock cart. The burden in one side and the person who is riding the bullock cart, his own weight, all in a rough road, the bulls have to carry the whole weight and the burden. In few days, if you see, the bulls will have a wound in their neck because of the yoke they carry every day. And that's the yoke. My dear beloved people, you may have lot of burden upon your yoke. It may be a problem of debt. There may be a financial lack. There may be a responsibility of taking care of all the children in the house. I tell you, God will never leave you nor forsake you. He will guide you. So don't keep this in your heart and be discouraged. Don't be upset by all the situations. Only one word from God, that is, keep all your burdens upon the Lord and He will take care of it. He will never let the righteous to be moved. So you may be saying, what will happen? How it can be changed? There's a beautiful word saying it. Only by the anointing, the yoke will be removed. Because of the anointing, the yoke will be removed. Spirit of God is upon you. There's a fire burning in you. Speak the faithful word. Greater than my yoke, greater than my debt, greater than my problems. Oh Jesus, you are greater. Just say this and praise God. I tell you, you will have a great peace in you. Let's pray with these words. Loving Heavenly Father, you have the authority over heaven and the earth. Oh Lord, our King Jesus, if the yoke can be broken by anointing, what are these yoke, what your children are bearing right now? Let every yoke be broken right now. Let your name be glorified. Bless them, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. My beloved people, don't forget to share to others. Speak to them with this message. You can register all your comments in your comment section. You can testify as a testimony. We'll see you again. God bless you. Our address, Jesus Meets Ministries, number 4, Kavarapalayam Main Road, Avadi, Chennai 54, India. Telephone number, 9841252836 7299546363 Email ID gpsrobinson at hotmail.com gps.office at jesusmeets.org Website address www.gpsrobinson.org